Police are still looking for whoever started the brawl at the Washington Avenue Armory. Seven people are recovering from their injuries. Six of them were stabbed. So right now, the push for answers is on. We know the band, Migos, is now banned from the Armory. But how did this happen? What was security like there? And what can be done to stop this from happening again? At first, I thought it was funny. And then, then it got serious when I saw the, bl the blood. Ready for a concert, 17-year-old Amari Jessup became witness to a crime and recorded the violence on his phone. Somebody come over here, yo! Well, Get out! Video show people throwing barricades and punches. Police say six people were stabbed, and a 19-year-old woman told officers she had been beaten and robbed in the bathroom. People uh, arguing, getting in each other's face, and then after that, punches were thrown, and then people started just, like, you know, going in. And into a, a huge brawl. The chaos at the concert caught the attention of city leaders who tell me they are fed up with reports of violence in and around the armory. You can't have a facility like that that is unsafe for people to be in. Mayor Kathy Sheehan pointed to a number of problems over the years, some as recent as January. The armory's owners even won court battles to continue operating. Now it's back to the drawing board. We're looking into all of our options that are available to us because we've got to take a hard look at what is going on there. What happened here? The armory is deeply disturbed. The armory spokesman argues security has improved. He says 35 security guards and five Albany police officers were on hand for the event, along with four EMTs, approved, he claims, by the APD. He also says everyone who showed up was wanted with metal detectors and patted down. You feel you have enough security on staff? This is um, standard security given the uh, concerns made by the Albany Police Department uh, and our own review as well. Right now, police are hunting for whoever did this, and the armory is under an especially strong microscope. What do you think needs to happen? I think that the, that, that the armory needs to look at whether or not it has the capacity and the capability of hosting these events. Now, Mayor Sheehan tells me she'll hold a special meeting tomorrow to see just what the city can do to keep things in line. The Armory, meanwhile, has banned Migos and what they consider those types of artists. No clarification there. Though the, a spokesman did tell me he's considering getting rid of hip-hop concerts altogether at the venue as staffers figure out how to move forward from here.